buddies what's up guys how are you how's everything this is guys a new setup and which i made for my friend and you can see we have added driftwood stones and aquarium soil and guys we are gonna make it plenty tank but right now we are waiting for nitrogen cycle to complete and i just set it up around one hour ago and you can see the air bubbles are still moving the air is trapped in the soil and you can see we have added the light and the back hang-on filters so guys today we are going to discuss about the hang-on filters so here i show you guys we have set this hang-on filter this is rs4000 model so today's video is about the rs filter and we are gonna give you the view and i will tell you that how it works so guys stay tuned and we are gonna start the video so guys here we have got the box and you can see we have got rs4000 and i am gonna open it up oh come on and yes guys it's open now and you can see we have got the filter inside here you can see and we have got the filtration media as well so here we have got the filtration media but now we are going to remove the cover and here we open and rest of the things we have got inside you can see we have got this and here we have the other filter and sponge as well and now we have the connection pipe and let's see what we have got inside and here we have got the wall for controlling the flow and what else we have and here we have got the inlet pipe and extension pipe and so guys here we have got the stuff and you can see so now we are going to assemble it here you can see all the things we have with this box so now we are going to fix it and i will show you that how to assemble it and before assembling i show you the model number here you can see rs electrical and you can see rs 4000 model on the bottom side you can see the pump which will drive up the water so guys this is the assembly and here you can see the plug for electrical power and it looks like this from the back side and the down side so here you can see the propeller in the white color it will suck the water and after filtration it will throw out the water so guys now we are going to assemble it up and i will show you that how to install it assembly guys let's have a look on the specs we have got the model voltages frequency power fit and flow rate and our model is 4000 and here you can see its flow rate is 1600 liters per hour and our tank is about 50 gallons so it is quite good for our tank so let's assemble it here we have got the stuff and First of all we are going to install this and you can see we have got the wall for controlling the water flow so we are going to fix it here here you can see a slot so we are gonna insert this plastic pipe here and you have to press it gently so that it may not get broken so here we go and now we are gonna fix the pipe here and you have to twist a little bit so that it may get fixed and do not twist too much otherwise it will break so now you can see by moving up and down we can control the flow rate of the water okay now here we have got the extension pipe and we are going to twist it like this to in fix it here and here we have got the inlet section you can see the perforations the water will get inside from these small perforations and now you can see we have 
completed it and here we have got the complete inlet assembly and by moving up and down this we can control the inlet flow and here we have got the skimmer and if you want to use it as a skimmer then you have to install it and it will suck the water from the top but right now we are not going to use it as a skimmer we just want it to work as hang-on filter so we will leave it and now we are going to install it here and now you can see we have got the propeller fan and guys remember you have to fix it tightly otherwise it will not work so we have to make it line for fixing it and here we have got a slot i can show you here and here you can see this is a slot for the proper fitting and you have to fix it tightly so that it may work properly so guys now you can see we have installed the inlet assembly of the water and now we are going to install the filtration media here we have got the blue filter these have the small holes and they have the activated charcoal inside these and here we have got the sponge and guys it will fix here the black sponge will filter out the larger particles and this minor particles will be filtered from these blue filtration media so the water will enter from here and after moving and after filtration from this filter it will get out back into the tank so here we have got the top cover and now we are gonna close it and guys this valve is for controlling the outflow of the water you can adjust it according to your requirement and this is the skimmer assembly if you want to use it as skimmer then you can fix it but we are not gonna fix it because i don't want to use it as a skimmer so now guys we are gonna install in the tank okay now you can see we have installed it at the corner of the tank and we have inserted the pipe for the water inlet and here you can see we have not filled the water in the tank now we are gonna fill the water in the tank as well after filling up the water in the tank you need to fill the water in this filter as well because if you don't fill the water here it will not work because it cannot automatically suck the water from the inlet so we need to fill it with the water here you can see now we have done it as now you can see after giving the electrical power it is working here and here i show you the water is coming back into the tank after filtration and it is working quite good and now we have put the top cover and now you can see it is working quite good and i hope that it will clear the water in 2 to 3 hours so guys this was today's video thank you for watching